Hi, I'm Sadie Maddock and this is the Appalachian Daily News for Wednesday, February 12th. Appalachian State's Provost is stepping down. Chancellor Sherry Everts announced Monday that Daryl Kruger, who began his tenure as Provost in 2015, would be stepping down. Kruger will remain a part of the Chancellor's Division in the Special Projects Department. Heather Norris was named Interim Provost and Executive Vice Chancellor for App State. Norris had served as the Dean of the Walker College of Business since 2016. Sandra Vanoy was named Acting Dean of the Walker College of Business effective February 10th to replace Norris. A national search for Provost and Executive Vice Chancellor will be established in the fall. The Appalachian Police Department has been named among the top 25 police departments for student safety. Safe Campus, the National Campus Safety Summit, ranked the Appalachian Police Department at 18 for making a difference in student safety in the United States. The special recognition comes months after the Police Academy at Appalachian State graduated its second class. Appalachian's Police Officer Development Program is a two-year program in which police cadets learn law enforcement skills while working alongside the Appalachian Police Department. Turn your passion into a profession. For those looking to enjoy the outdoor activities of the high country, the Outdoor Jobs Fair will take place today in the Grandfather Ballroom of the Plymouth Student Union. The event is sponsored by the Career Development Center and takes place from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Looks like it's going to be another wet day here in Boone. Expect light rain and drizzle throughout the day with patches of fog. Cloudy and cooler today with a high of 48 and a low of 45, accompanied by a 5 to 15 mile per hour southwest wind. That's all for us today. Be sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at App Weekly News for all the latest in the high country. For more in-depth stories that we didn't get to cover here, tune into App TV or watch apptv.com at 3 p.m. on Friday for our weekly show, the Appalachian Weekly News. We'll see you next time.